Hi, I'm going to show you how to access your Gmail account from Google and then activate your Google Voice or just simply access it if it's already been created. So what you need to do is go to the address bar which is at the top of your browser window and it normally starts with something like HTTP um, and it's different from the search window. You wouldn't type in your Gmail address here in the search window you actually need to type it here in the address bar. So what you do is go to www.gmail.com and you're going to get to the sign-in window and then what you need to do is type in your username and your password and then click sign in. Once you're signed into your Gmail account, what you need to do is go to the More tab and then scroll down and click on Even More. And once again, scroll down and under the Home and Office subheading, you'll find Voice. Click on the Voice link and you'll be uh, shown a getting started set up your Google Voice number you can use Google Voice with a brand new number from Google or your existing mobile phone number alright so I'll say right now I want a new number but you may already have a mobile phone which is fine you can use your cell phone number um, and your Google Voice will go straight to your cell phone so I'm gonna type in I want a new number choose your number first we need to pick a new Google number when anyone calls this number it will ring all of your phones so we'll just click search numbers or it wants a zip code so I'll put uh, or area code so I'll put 313 and then click search numbers I'll select one that you know I think I'll, I'll remember and then I'll click continue alright it's gonna ask you to create a new pin uh, just like a bank pin number uh, so put whatever pin number you feel uh, you'll be able to remember accept the Google Voices terms and privacy policy and then click continue it's going to ask you for a forwarding phone that will ring when your Google Voice number is called you can add more forwarding phones later so I'm going to put my mobile number as the forwarding phone number and then click continue it's going to ask you to, to confirm it so I'm going to click on call me now it's actually going to call me So you need to answer the phone and then put in the code that's there, which is 65. So I'm just going to enter that in. All right, so now my account is active. And now I can give out my number, my Google Voice number, and I will get transcribed voicemail sent to my inbox. And then I'll be able to send free text messages and make cheap international calls. All right. I'll click finish and here is my brand new shiny uh, Google Voice account alright in order to create a voicemail and customize it what you need to do is go to the settings panel which looks like the button looks like a, a gear and it has a downward facing triangle in the upper right hand corner click on that button and choose the settings option and then click on the voicemail and text menu to record a new voicemail greeting what you do is click on record new and then you can name it whatever you want. I'll name this my first greeting. My and then click continue. And what's going to happen is it's going to call you 
either on Google Talk or on your phone alright and then you'll be able to leave your message so I'll have it call my mobile phone number and then click connect it should take just a moment Hi, you've reached the Creation Station CGLC. Please leave your name and number, and I will call you back as soon as possible. Thank you. alright so now my greeting has been saved I'll go out here and click play and hi you've reached the creation station CGLC please leave your name and number and I will call you back as soon as possible thank you alright that's fine if you want to record your name you can also do it the same way you can have Google call your phone by simply clicking on record new and then you record a new voicemail and follow the prompts that pop up on your phone and once you're done what you need to do is click on save changes and now whenever someone calls the number that you specified as your Google voice number or that has already been set up uh, you'll get voicemails to your account and it'll also ring your phone all right, you can always come back here to the settings panel to change those options if you want. Uh, I hope this tutorial has been helpful. Let me know if you have any questions, and I will try to address them as soon as possible. Thank you.